The Oakland Robotics Association is entering the Intelligent Ground Vehicle Competition this year with something they didn't have last year, omnidirectional wheels. That means their robot will be able to move in any direction. In addition to moving forward and backward and turning, it will also be able to move left and right. So to get around an obstacle, let's say, let's say it's over here, it's trying to go that way. There's an obstacle in its way. Instead of having to turn and drive around it, what it can do is it can just go like this to get around it. <laughs> Though the robot currently moves by remote control, by the time of the competition, it will be controlled by a computer program that will use sensors and cameras to find a path for the robot to follow. The robot has to navigate and it so, yeah, uh, that's comes the only across thing different well, obstacles. That box, having so that box then, down too is important. Which way to move, to know where to move, and how fast it passes. It all this comes under path planning. Oh, that's pretty, yeah, it's so pretty all the decision making I take is because because artificial intelligence. Well, in the remaining weeks before the competition, the Oakland Robotics Association will have challenges ahead as it fine-tunes the structure and the movement of the robot for the competition. The Aerial Systems Club will have similar challenges with its quad rotor, which also uses pathfinding computer programs. The OU Society of Automotive Engineers was the last of the engineering teams preparing for an upcoming competition but they said they still had a lot of work to do on their Formula Racer in preparation for their competition that was little more than a week away. One of the things that happens a lot of the times when you get a state this one currently is in is that you get a lot of, you have to take something off to put something back on or test something different and then, you know, put back on what you took off earlier. So a lot of back and forth with that. The Michigan SAE Formula Racer Competition, which concluded recently, ended with Oakland University taking 69th place out of 123 schools entering a Formula Racer.